Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Meredith E. Phillips. I'm a writer, reader, and bunny mama, and this is the very first 2021 vlog in which I'm going to start rereading my NaNoWriMo 2020 project. My big goal this year is to completely revise my NaNo 2020 project, which was Project Model Rom-Com, if you remember. And the first step for I think pretty much everyone, I don't know anyone who doesn't do this, but one of the first steps in revising is to just reread the entire thing from start to finish. And what I'm gonna try to do with this first time around is just read through the whole piece as I would if I was a reader. I'm not gonna try to take notes, I'm not gonna be changing anything, I'm just gonna be reading it straight through just to get back into the flow of it get into the flavor of it again and then after i've finished that i'll go back through and do a much slower reread trying to take notes and notate things that i need to be changed or whatever i'm gonna go ahead and get the document pulled up i haven't opened it at all i haven't really done let's be honest here it is january 10th i haven't done anything writing related since last year before Christmas. <laughs> so part of me was like, you should feel bad about it. You didn't start writing on January 1st, no. And I was like, you know what? No. I was on my little break on January 1st through that weekend. I didn't want to do anything. I wasn't planning to do anything. Am I late getting started with New Year's resolution type of stuff? I guess, but also I don't care. So I'm gonna start today and I'm a little nervous to reread it because I'm sure it's gonna be rough, but Let's go ahead and get the document pulled up and start reading. Psych, I forgot I have a new computer, so I need to transfer it from my old computer and put it on this one. So I gotta do that first and then I will get to reading. Okay, we're all good to go now. I actually, thank you past self. I saved it as, of course, a Scrivener document, but I also saved it as a PDF. So I'm gonna just read through the PDF. That way, like, I can't change anything because it's a PDF, not the actual text document. It's 126 pages. I think what I'm going to try to do, I'd love to get through the whole thing today. I don't know if I'm going to. I'd like to get through at least half today. Let's make that the goal. 126 divided by 2 is 6363 pages. <laughs> um, so let's go ahead and get to reading. Reread is not going great. <laughs> I'm on page 11. I saw something that made me really upset and it just another reason why your phone should not be next to you on the table while you're trying to work. Yeah, and I'm just trying to like kind of calm down from that so I can refocus on this reread. Like I'm literally shaking. You know when you get so angry about something, you're shaking, you're physically shaking about it. I'm trying to just calm myself down. I'm freezing, that's why I've got this blanket on. It's not going great. <laughs> not because the work is necessarily like awful or something, but exterior factors, I guess. So far, there's definitely things where I'm like, <laughs> that needs to be changed in the, in the manuscript I'm talking about. But I do really like how it is throwing you into the story like immediately. I don't spend a lot of time at the beginning on stuff that doesn't matter. It's not like, oh, we're just following this person around their entire day and just kind of seeing what all they're doing. Like there's plot points kind of stuff, important things happening like right away. So I think that's good. <laughs> and um, it doesn't, it doesn't feel like I'm wasting a lot of space talking about things or showing the characters doing stuff that really doesn't matter. So please, so far, I'm going to, I need to do something to kind of calm down before I can come back to this. So yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I should probably pet a bunny. Let's see if there are any bunnies out and I'll go pet them.
Okay, I'm back at the bunnies. Took a breath. I made a hot beverage for myself. Yum. It's just like one of those drink mixes, like coffee drink mixes. Anyway, it is almost quarter after four. I still have a couple hours. I have to go pick up my husband from work today. So I'm going to try to get through to page 60. What did we say? 63? still got like 50 pages to go so let's 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 keep going <laughs> i'm on page 30 i wrote this for myself <laughs> felt the loss of heat like bracket some great metaphor or simile here thanks past me <laughs> i have a lot of bracket notes to myself where like i couldn't think of something in the moment while i was writing it so i just was like put something awesome here like earlier they go to a donut shop and i'm like insert good type of donut here so there's notes like that throughout the whole document it's going much better it's about quarter to five and i'm about halfway done with what i said i was going to do today let's keep reading <laughs> okay i'm almost done reading through the first half i'm on page 55 and <laughs> it's good i really like it <laughs> I'm really excited to get started on actually revising stuff. The one thing that is consistent throughout the entire piece that is just, it, I guess it's just how I write first drafts, but I am such an underwriter. Like I have not described anybody hardly. I haven't described the rooms they're in. I haven't, like everything's happening really fast and there's no sort of breathing room in between. I don't know if that makes sense, but it's just very, um, there just needs to be a little more detail added to sort of bring things to life, I think, but I'm, I'm really excited. I think it's fun. I know you're supposed to read your first draft and be like, oh, it's a bunch of crap. There's absolutely things that need to be fixed. And like, I've noticed there's one part where I said the main female character is tall and then another part where I said she's short so you know stuff like that inconsistencies yeah I'm gonna finish reading hopefully in the next 10 or 15 minutes then I've got some other things to do before I need to go pick up my husband in a little over an hour so far so good on this read through <laughs> okay I made it to the halfway point in the story I made it to, I think I wait I'm on page 66 of the pdf so halfway through I'm hoping I can finish reading it tomorrow maybe we'll see but yeah so far so good it's definitely fun i really like the story <laughs> so i'm excited to see what i think of the end there's definitely things where it's like it's too convenient the way it's working out or it's too abrupt the way it's working out so there's things there i need to develop and like fix but i'm excited to do the work we'll see how it goes tomorrow hey guys it is wednesday and i'm getting ready uh, for my first live stream so I'm hoping that like a few people show up <laughs> so I won't be all by myself but I'm looking forward to it I am me so I'm like nervous <laughs> about it but I'm sure it'll go fine I'm going to be hopefully rereading the last half of the first draft because I haven't done anything over the last two days with writing stuff that's my goal for the stream we'll see I don't know if I'll get to finish reading the whole thing during the stream if I don't then I'm I have I only have like 60 some pages left so if I don't finish it during the stream, I'll finish it for sure tonight. I do want to finish rereading it today so that hopefully by tomorrow, I guess, I can start reading it and like taking notes and all that kind of stuff. A little over half an hour before all this gets started. So I'll just sit here nervously until it's ready to go. <laughs> all right, cool. Hey everyone, how's it going? I'm so glad to see a couple of you here. Um, thank you so much for joining me today. Yeah, I'm ready to get some writing work done. I just wanted to sort of reiterate a little bit what was in the original video that I did sort of announcing these. Um, the idea for this is that it is a work session, essentially. <sighs> I did it. I did my first live stream. Ah, <sighs> I feel so tired. <laughs> Oh man, as an introvert, it was a lot of fun, but it also just like takes a lot out of me. So I'm excited to do the second one. I hope if you joined, you got some work done. I had like 19 people, I think on it at the most, but there were a lot of you there. I was, I was really surprised, honestly. I was like, man, I hope like a couple people show up at least, you know, thinking like, oh my gosh, if I had like 10 people, that would be like the max I was expecting. So to have, 
that many people there that's so great i'm so happy uh that it was helpful and i there were a lot of people commenting at the end like they got some solid work in which is the point so i'm glad that it was um it went well and that people showed up so i'm excited to do the next one let me know if you have any kind of preference i'm planning to do it either the the last Saturday or Sunday of this month. And then I'm totally open on timing. So I was thinking to try to do something a little earlier, like 10 or 11 in the morning so that people ahead, cause we do, I did have quite a few people in Europe. There's one person who showed up who's in the United Arab Emirates, which was cool. Anyway, they're just way farther ahead in terms of time zone. So I'm trying to do something earlier in the day so that it'll be like still an actual awake time <laughs> for them. Thank you to those of you who were coming from really far ahead and staying up late just to say hey and take part in part of it so that was awesome anyway it is now six o'clock a little after six I need to go get dinner I did make progress probably should tell you what I actually got done huh I am on almost page 100 of my reread so I'm definitely gonna finish it tonight and then I'll get started on actually taking notes and doing that kind of thing tomorrow I'm gonna go ahead and go I need I need like a time to just sort of like introvert myself and I'll talk to you a little later when I'm back to reading hey guys it is Thursday and I'm going to to be wrapping up this vlog. I just finished rereading the end of my draft and I'm really I'm really happy with it. There's definitely a lot to change. There's definitely a lot to change. I have a lot of work to do, but the overall story, the overall structure, the characters, I really like it. I even like the ending, like the last line. It's not great. It'll definitely change, but at least it's like a decent ending line you know what I mean <laughs> I've written other things where the ending line is just like really stupid like well anyway on to the rest of our lives kind of stupid <laughs> thing just to be done <laughs> but this ending line is like at least palatable I think so that was it was just encouraging it was encouraging to reread it it was a different experience than I've had rereading other finished work or you know finished first drafts of mine so I'm really excited to get started on rereading it with the intention of taking notes and figuring out what to not just what to change but how to change it so I'm excited about that a little apprehensive I think just because the last time I did this it went really poorly and it was very difficult I'm excited to get started though I think this will be easier because I think what I'm starting with is already a better story than what I had previously in past works in progress I'm gonna go ahead and cut this off and I will see you back here on Tuesday Tuesday if I can get it done it's gonna be an exciting video to put out I'm really oh, it's taken a lot of work but I think it'll be ready on Tuesday and um I'm excited to share it with you. So definitely make sure you come back for that. So yeah, thank you so much for watching today. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, go ahead and click the subscribe button. I post videos on Tuesdays and Fridays. You can also find me over on Instagram at Meredith Phillips Writes. I'll see you on Tuesday. Bye. Hmm. How should I do this? Oh, nope. Don't do that. What a pit. It looks like a pit back there. Thank you guys for making it a good first experience. That sounded like something else. Okay.